Your second option is creating a character face sheet. This is something that is often done in comics or cartoons when an artist is getting the feel for a character. They will create a sheet with the same character showing different emotions. Common emotions they show are a basic resting face, a happy face, a sad face, an angry face, and a surprised face. The face changes between each of these emotions, so it's important to know how the expressions are shown. The resting face is the one that the character will have when they're not trying to show a specific emotion. So, like, think of it as, like, your face when you are watching uh, someone in the front of the class. Like, you're just there. You're not feeling super excited or angry or sad. You're just kind of there. So, it's normally how you would draw a portrait and just having all of the features on the face. With a happy face, the main focus is the eyes and the mouth. The eyes close slightly so you could add a line under them to make it look like they are closing. The mouth turns up at the corners to make it look like a smile. Sadness uses the same features as well as the eyebrows. The eyes close slightly as well. The eyebrows almost come down and closer to the center. Like when they, your eyebrows, you can f try practice frowning. You can feel them move a little bit. And then the opposite happens to the mouth when you are sad as opposed to happy, so the corners turn down like a frown. Often with cartoons and comics, when you are showing anger, the eyebrows almost appear diagonal, like the lower part is towards the center of your face and the ends of your eyebrows are higher up. You can also add lines under the eyes like they are closed or squinting, and the mouth may tilt down, or you could add C like a seed to the edge to make it look like the cheeks are puffed up. Lastly, the surprise face gets really big. The eyebrows go up really high. The eyes look much bigger. So like where you draw where your iris and your pupil are will not be connected to any other part of your eye to make them look really big. And the mouth can make like an O shape. For this option, you need to have five expressions drawn using the same character and take a picture to upload to this activity. Also tell me which emotion was the most interesting for you to make.